Anin, Buju, Makade, Bene, Sainish, Nikos, Migizi, Dodem. Hi, it's Jamie here, and we're back with part four of five in our smudge series. And in this video, I'll talk a little bit about why I smudge. I kind of mentioned a little bit in previous videos, but I can't speak for what other people do per se, but I can tell you about what I do, why I smudge. And I feel like if you ask someone else, their answer is going to sound different. You're going to hear some really unique stuff, probably, because the reason why each of us does this particular ceremony sometimes is very personal. Um, there'll be some similarities, of course, but really, it's all about you and uh, why you do it. So why I do it is because I want to clear the space around me. I want to clear my own energy, my own thoughts, and my own preparation for what's the next step, what's going to be the task at hand. And uh, if you've ever watched people smudge, they kind of have a moment of, okay, and it's like settling themselves, preparing themselves for the next step that's coming. And there's also you know, smudging, like I smudge my hands because I do a lot of work with my hands, um, especially before I create stuff, because if I'm creating stuff for myself or I'm creating stuff for someone else, I try and create stuff in a way that they're going to last a good while. And I want to put forth my best effort, my best energy, because I feel like those ceremony objects for example carry that energy forward and if it's going to be for somebody else i want to be in the best possible space put out my best possible effort because i want to make something beautiful and i want to make something that's going to last a while especially if i'm giving it to someone else and we'll also smudge ceremonial objects so when we work with a, an eagle feather or an eagle fan, for example, we'll smudge that so that it doesn't carry what it doesn't need to carry. Um, same for other ceremonial items, you know, we'll pass it through the smoke and uh, kind of smudge it and, or we'll use it to aid our work as we, we do that work. So that's a little bit about why I smudge. And if you have anything that you want to share, or if you want to uh, comment about why you smudge, I look forward to hearing from you and generating some good positive discussion about smudging. And, uh, or if you want to share something else, other teachings, that'd be fantastic. So that's all I think I'll share in this video and uh, come back for part five. We'll see you then.